Chris Johnson is going away for 20 years. That's because the government says he tried to swindle money from them and also tried to buy $8 million worth of luxury cars and a house in Mobile Bay, but without enough money in the bank to pay for any of that. That's all according to federal court testimony. Johnson, also known as Tariq Akil Anad, engaged in these scams between March 2020 and January 2021. To further his fraud scheme, Johnson mailed packages and sent emails to financial institutions and other individuals in violation of the federal wire fraud statute. The jury reviewing bank records proving Johnson did not have the money to legitimately purchase the items he wanted. Now, Johnson also tried to fraudulently obtain SBA funding for COVID-19 relief money and did not tell the truth to the SBA about his citizenship when applying for a Social Security card, citing membership in a fictitious tribe that is not federally recognized. Johnson also illegally used Social Security numbers belonging to two deceased individuals.